Welcome to the Video Dictionary, and it's time for another quick entry. Cloud. Noun. A visible mass of particles, usually floating some distance above the ground. Recently it's come to refer to off-site resources accessed via the internet. History and etymology. If you're looking for the origin of the word cloud, all you need to do is look down. That's right. The word cloud evolved from a word that meant rock. That word was clawed, and it meant a mass of rock or a hill. The first time the word appears, even in a metaphorical sense to refer to clouds as we know them, is in the 1300s. Even in the passage quoted by the Oxford English Dictionary, the word cloud is appended with of the air to differentiate it from the normal use or original use of the word cloud at the time. Here's that passage. Cloudes of the air. Even in modern English, we still use a variant of the word cloud to refer to dirt, like dirt clods. I don't think I've heard the word used since I was a child, so I'm not sure if it's still in use, but I suspect it is. And a version of this word even came into use in a medical sense, that word being clot, like a blood clot, or any coagulation of a liquid could, I guess, be called a clot. Cloud was originally used metaphorically, and that metaphor became its literal meaning. And it's being used metaphorically again, to this time to refer to that off-site storage I mentioned in the definition. As early as 1977, ARPANET and CSNET, predecessors to the internet, were using the symbol of a cloud in diagrams to represent entire systems or networks whose inner workings weren't required to be understood for the rest of the diagram to be understood. This is how the idea of cloud became associated with networks that you may not see or off-site or are not understood. And later on, the first recorded use of the word itself, cloud, as in cloud computing, was internal documents for the company Compaq. And it wasn't until 2006 when Amazon released its cloud computing product that the word was popularized by Amazon. Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please leave a like and share it with your friends who might find it interesting. If you're into history and words, again, subscribe to the channel and click the little bell so that you never miss a word. And until next time, keep on learning.